Welcome back, guys. Your favorite pawnbrokers are back again this week. This is our show number six, and it's going to be a good one for you. Let's go to the jeweler's vault first, and they're going to have some rings, but also bracelets and charms for you to choose from. They always have a nice selection of jewelry on there. And then on to Grandma's Buffet with David and Gray. We look forward to seeing you there because we've got some sports memorabilia for you this week. Then we're going to go sound shopping. That's with our man Gray. They're going to introduce you to some fine looking guitars, but also they're going to have a violin on this program and some vinyl albums for sale also. Coming right up guys, hang on. I'm Kenny Barnes and I'm a pawnbroker. My family and I have been doing brick and mortar stores for 29 years. We've got 10 of them across the Carolinas. Ever since we opened our first store in 1989, we've been battling the reputation of one of the world's oldest industries. I believe every American ought to have access to a pawnbroker they can trust. So we created the Pawn Shopping Network, our new online store and live TV show. We want to change your mind about pawnbrokers, one transaction at a time. Our crew's here to help you, so now let's go pawn shopping. Welcome to the Pawn Shopping Network. I'm Alma. I'm Chad the Jeweler. And here we are, Chad, already on our sixth episode. Actually, technically seven if you count yeah, our introductory our show. One, right. Yeah. So we've had a good six, seven weeks here in front of the viewers. We hope y'all mm -hmm. are having a good time joining us. We have had viewers from all over the United States and even in other countries, I believe. Oh, yeah. Through Facebook. Yeah, it's really cool. And so, you know, if you're not familiar with us, we come to you live every Wednesday right here at, on Facebook at noon. And then on Thursdays, you can watch us locally on um, Spectrum Cable. So you right. can check our website for the channel guide for that. We want to start off today with a shout out to Yaga Adato. He is with the um, Pawn Brokers Advisory Forum. We had a nice conversation with him yesterday evening, and we hope you're tuning in today and you like what you see. So let's get started today, Chad. All right. We're going to start off today, and I'm sure you'll like this one. We oh, talked about I will. It's the Blue Topaz. This one right here is a nice little emerald cut. It's the London Blue Topaz, which is more of a turquoise blue, which we talk about the colors all the time. And this one right here, if, if you or born in December, this is pretty much close to your birthstone, which is usually a blue zircon, but that's the type of color that it is right there, that nice turquoise blue. It's a beautiful ring. It's got diamonds on the side, three on each side. It's in 14-karat uh, yellow gold, and it's seven and a half. And folks, since I'm a jeweler, we can size that ring and have it packed up and sent to you in a new box, and usually we can get it done right away. And the shipping's free, and we've got a 30-day money-back guarantee, so no way you can lose on that. That is a beautiful ring, really, really pretty. We've got it priced at $179.95, and as you can see, the color is just beautiful on it, too. Nice little emerald cut. Got your diamonds, too, on the sides. Now, what color of blue topaz did you say this was? London. London blue. I don't know why it's London blue, but it's London blue is London what they call it. Blue. Those in the field know that, that color. Usually you have sky, Swiss blue, which is that Caribbean blue color, and then you've got the London blue, which is more of a turquoise blue. That is really pretty. Beautiful like ring. And this one right here, folks, I can size it really pretty much wherever you want. So down or up, we include that in it. So yeah, we have Mother's Day coming up actually this Sunday. So this yes. is something you want to grab up for Mother's Day. Give us a call right now, 844-641-PAWN. You'll speak to an actual live pawnbroker when you call in. It won't just be an operator. It'll mm -hmm. be somebody who knows what they're talking about. Uh, give us a call if you would like to get that ring or if you feel better shopping online, you can hop over to pawnsouth.com. And click on shop, and you can go right to the jewelry tab and search for the ring by mm -hmm. item number or by description, and you can look at all the other jewelry we have on there as well. Yeah, so. and we also have live brokers online right now, too, that click on that little tab that chat. We've That's got right. somebody that, well, you can text it right to us now. That's right. There's a little chat box in the bottom right, little red um, chat mm -hmm. bubble. You can click on that, and you'll mm -hmm. chat instantly with, again, one of our pawn brokers. So you can get hooked up right away. We're here to give you good service. If they can't answer, they'll walk out here and ask. That's right. <laughs> we'll, we'll get you an answer the show, as fast This is live, y'all, yep. so we can, we'll see them answering the phone. If they have a question for us, we'll answer it for them. So y'all right. go right ahead and give us a call if you need to. We'll move on now to our second item, which is kind of cool right here. Nice little circle, like a circle halo diamond pendant. You got a nice round edge, two-thirds carat total weight. Uh, the pendant itself is 14 karat white gold, and it's on a 18 karat gold box chain. 
which is really, really cool too. 18 carats is super nice. It's got the lobster claw with it and everything. Six ninety nine ninety five. Two thirds carats means that it's in that 50 to 60 point range. Well, not 50, but 60, 55, 58, 60 point in diamond weight. All right, so we'll get a close-up over here with our other camera. You'll notice the center stone. And this, this piece here didn't come out of the store like that. It's, you know, maybe the circle did, but then the diamond's been added to the middle of it. It just doesn't, it just didn't come in like that. So it's kind of a custom piece, too, which is really nice. And you can see it's beautiful. Got some nice pieces there. Good shot. Six ninety nine ninety five. And how long is that chain? The chain is 18 inches long. Okay. If you need it shortened down to a 16, I can do that before we ship it. Can't make it a lot longer, but I can definitely make it shorter. That's right. You know, we want to make y'all happy, so if we need to adjust something, we will. Mm -hmm. Comes in a nice gift box. If you want it for Mother's Day, you got to buy it now so we can get it in the mail to you. Get it out there. There we go, y'all. That's item three seven 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 six ninety nine ninety five. Mm -hmm. Once again, if you're interested in that, give us a call or shop online. Oh yeah. We're giving you many options there. And, you know, if you're not familiar with the show, like we said in the beginning, each week we're going to present to y'all 25 new items. Mm -hmm. Actually, was that right? 25 for the whole show. 25 right? for the whole show. Yeah, I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. So we have several um, shows within the hour. We'll have two jewelry shows and two collectible shows and a music show. Mm -hmm. So each week we'll add those items to our website, and you can shop as it grows every week. So make sure you're following us and share us on your Facebook page. And, mm -hmm. you know, speaking of Facebook, I'm, I'm looking at that right now. If you're watching us, give us a thumbs up, a howdy. Let us know where you are and where you're watching from. We'll try to give you a shout-out if we can. All right, what's our next item? We have got a nice channel set, ruby and diamond. Channel, mean, channel set means it's set down below the surface of the gold. There's no prong, so it's really smooth across the top. The rubies in that are beautiful. Diamonds, it's alternating ruby and diamond. It's in 14 karat yellow gold. Uh, channel set, and, and pretty much it'll, if, you, if you're wearing just any type of solitaire, it'll pretty much go right up against it because it's very low base, so it'll go right up against the prongs or under most of the rings. This one right here is a size eight right now. You can see the rubies are really pretty, red, yellow gold, 14 karat, $349.95. And everything on it, the diamonds, the rubies, everything's nice quality. And that's, the rubies are red, the diamonds are white, you know, so that's, that's kind of what you want there. It's beautiful. Size 8, and it being a channel set, I can't size it down to like that 4 or 5, but I can definitely size it to a 6, and I can size it up. So if you wear a 4 and a half, I'm just telling you, don't buy it. <laughs> but if you wear anything else, let's get it. Get it home to you. Three forty nine ninety five. That is a pretty ring. Mm -hmm. And folks, too, we love vintage pieces and things like that. So if you have some sitting at home that you, you know, was missing a stone or two, or if you just don't want it anymore and you want to sell it, you know, if it's your grandmother's, you know, and it's not doing any good in the jewelry box, sell it to us. We're, we're very interested in it. We'd like to know the stories that you have with it, too, and send it to us. And even, like I said, if it's missing stones, maybe we can patch it up and make it a nice home somewhere. That's right. All right, let's go to our next item okay. there. I'll try to take this one off. If I can't get it off, it's going to have to go home with me. <laughs> now, this one right here I think is kind of neat. This, this makes a nice ring or like even make one. a nice pinky ring for some people. It's two marquees. It's uh, 3 eighths carat total weight. They're kind of set at an angle a little bit. As you can see, it's 14 carat white gold, three ninety nine ninety five, And you can see it's, it's just a, a neat little ring. As you can see there, it's good for pinky and, you know, some people wear it on the other hand, too, on, the, on the other fingers, too. Three-eighths of a carat, and I can size this one to wherever you need. If you need a size, if you're a size, a size one, I can make it that. I can size it up, too. That is a I really, really think that's a, ring. That's a cute yeah. ring, too. Really nice ring. Mm -hmm. And now this is, what size did you say this was? That one right there is a size seven right now. All right, a size seven. That is a pretty mm -hmm. ring, you know. And we, you know, we mentioned that we had um, Mother's Day coming up. We also mm -hmm. have um, graduations coming up real soon, y'all. Mm -hmm. That makes a really nice graduation gift there. Mm -hmm. Nice Mother's Day graduation. Sure Got a little bit of longer time, so if you know a young lady that's graduating, that makes a nice graduation yeah. gift right there. And it's, it, it, you know, it's really not an engagement ring. It could be, I yeah. guess, but it makes a nice pinky ring. It makes a nice right hand ring. Just makes a, a pretty little ring. So very nice ring. And really nice and ring. The, and the two marquees are decent size too. They're not like they're teeny. You know, you've got just under a quarter of a carat each. So. Really nice. All mm -hmm. right, y'all. Yeah, that's item thirty-seven mm -hmm. eighty-three. Give us a call if that's something you might like to purchase today. All right, Chad. We're down to our last, our last item. One, Let's yeah. see what we have now. We have got a nice little bracelet right there. It's kind of a mesh 
looking 14 karat gold bracelet, okay. as you can see right there. Seven inches long, 14 karat yellow gold, 6.6 .6 grams, $299.95. It's got the lobster claw on it. Nice, it's got the end caps and lobster claw, so it's a very secure piece right there. And it's just different. It's got a kind of a little meshy look okay. to it. It's not, it's not a herring bone or anything like that, so it's, got, it's pretty flexible. It's just a good looking bracelet. And gold, yeah. gold these days is like really expensive too. If you, 6.6 .6 grams, I know in the retail store you're probably talking 600 bucks, somewhere around there, five to 600 at, that, at minimum. So it's seven inches long. We could probably shorten it for you. Can't make it much longer. 299.95. Like I said, it's, it's in yellow gold. I don't know if sometimes the pictures on TV is hard to tell, but you can tell it is yellow gold. And All right. that brings up too, if you've got just gold at home, bracelets that are broken, things like that, we want to buy that too. We're That's always right. interested in the precious metals, whether it's broken, in great shape, or whatever. You know, we've got people stand by for you just to call. There give you an idea of what we can give you for it. And we need to make them busy, so y'all need to call yep. and give them something to do. Let's... Yeah, I think they're just kind of hanging out. They're hanging out back there watching right. us, making us nervous, and making right. faces at us, and giving us hand signals and everything. So y'all give them a call, and then yeah. we'll see them work while and we're Please there. like and share us. We, we're trying to reach as many people as we can. Yeah, so if you're, again, like I said, if you're watching on Facebook, give us a thumbs up, a howdy. Um, share that you're watching it so we mm -hmm. can just get it all across, get all your family and friends looking at it. We might find homes for stuff, yeah. you know. The collectors, um, collectibles are coming up next and a musical instrument. So if you know anybody interested in that, make sure you share this with them. Give us an idea where you're from, too. We like to see how far out we've reached people. Yeah. All right. Well, we're going to leave y'all for, for now. We'll be back at the end of the show. Mm -hmm. I hope you enjoy Grandma's Buffet with David and Gray coming up next. It's always interesting with them. Y'all take care. In here with Pond South Elizabethtown. Check out and follow our Facebook page. We're posting daily deals that you won't want to miss. We're number one in the Carolinas at cash and deals. Stop by and see us. Hey everybody, we're on a shopping spree. We're picking up some of the best deals at our stores to bring to you on our show and our website, PondSouth.com. Now let's go pond shopping. Here we go. There we are again, David. Looks just like you. us. Grandma's Buffet with David and Gray, guys. Show number six. We're on the way. We're going to try to reach a thousand in the next few years, but I hope oh so, David. Me. Yes, that's a long road to hope. Oh, we can do it, buddy. I'm glad y'all tuned in with us today. We want to say hi to a couple of people there. Hey, Casey, glad you're watching. Jacob down in Wilmington, glad you're watching us. Guys, we're here to sell you some collectibles today, and we've got some sports memorabilia. That's right, some nice stuff um, too, Dave. Yeah, we'll start off with sports and, uh, and some really nice stuff, great prices. Let us remind you, if this is your first time watching us, guys, one-of-a-kind items. We don't have multiples of these things, do we? Right. David, these are um, one of a kind, just like us, just like PSN. Just like PSN, right. we're one of a kind. Well, we want to find homes for this stuff, is what the boss man said, right. David. We've got to find homes for it, and that's what our collectibles, want to our sound shop, and yeah, everything. Give a shout out to all the uh, other pawnbrokers out there in the in the United States and around wherever you're watching us from. We uh, we hope you're enjoying this and what we're trying to do to promote the pawn industry and and show everybody that they can trust pawnbrokers. Oh, we yeah. are. We are business people that are out here to help. And right now, we're going to help build your collection of sports memorabilia. That's right. Well, David, this is unique PSN, this new endeavor we've started. We buy, David. We want to tell everybody that. We buy your stuff. So give us right. a call, 1-844-641-PON. You can actually talk to a live pawn broker. They're waiting guys, for you today. We buy and sell. Yes, sir. I believe the, the guys boss are man's on in the there phone again. And he is today, too, guys. You can talk to our, our owner, Mr. Kenny Barnes. He's, he's manning the phones today also. But let's get started, Greg. That's right. Well, Dave, this is kind of unique. We've got some uh, 
posters here of a Mr. Babe Ruth. Mm -hmm. And now he did not play. We're talking about Mr. Gary Cooper. He played Mr. the Gary part Cooper. of Lou Gehrig in a movie. But it looks like he's in the Yankee uniform right. in Yankee Stadium, but this is actually Gary Cooper with the babe. Now, the babe right. is up in age here, but he's there during the filming of the movie. So it is Lou Gehrig playing Gary Cooper. Right. But we've also got... Oh, well, Gary Cooper playing Lou Gehrig. Yeah. But this is Mr. Mickey who? Mantle. Mickey Mantle. Now, he did play for right. the Yankees. So kind when of I was young there. and you were playing baseball well, out in the yard, Every, everybody wanted to be Mickey Mantle at right. the plate. You know, I'm Mickey Mantle, and then you go hit you a get home run. a shot run. of that, David. See if Mr. Ethan yeah. can give us a shot Ethan, of the camera, Ethan, you working today? Yeah, Wake up working. over there. He's with us, I guarantee you. By the way, guys, we want to mention our, our set here. We're by the magic of television. We're back again in downtown Bladenboro at Pond USA. I mean, Pond South. <laughs> Did I do that? Yeah. But we're oh, in the Bridgers building, David. Guys, it was good being here with you, yeah. and I'll see you somewhere yeah. down the road. But item 3812, Dave, 1495. So everybody's budget, David. Give us a call or right. go on pondsouth.com. In good condition to be the They're real good too. condition, David. The Mickey Mantle the picture was dated back in 1959. Uh, you remember then? The date on, is Correct. there a date on the other picture there, Gray? It was. Uh, David, I didn't see one. Mm hmm. There's Mr. But Mickey that was the Mantle. making of a movie. What, do you remember, recall the name of that movie? Could it, it be in The Gipper? No, it was The Pride of the oh, Yankees. The Pride of the Yankees? I know it was yeah, one of them. Yeah, Pride of the Yankees. They were making that movie when, when this photograph was taken of Babe Ruth. Mantle and, uh, was in 1959. They think that the uh, Gary Cooper stuff was maybe in the 30s, David. That had been a while. Probably. Yeah, it's been a while. That's right. Been well, that's item number one there number here one. on Grandma's Buffet with David and Gray. Item number two, we're going to get into a little basketball here, guys. If you're a fan of the Philadelphia 76ers, mm -hmm. we've got a, uh, a beer tap lever. The uh, 76ers, it actually looks to be their old logo. David, that is the old emblem. This is when they played in the Spectrum. This is when uh, Maurice Cheeks, Moses Malone, uh, Dr. Dr. J, J, all yeah, those Julie guys. Serving. Uh, Darryl Daw those guys right there, this is the old emblem of the 76ers, but it is a beer tap, light beer. But the Philadelphia 76ers, right. David, some history there. They won a championship there. there they're too. off to a rough start this year, though, guys. I think they're two and three in the season. Right. And, and let me tell you, the Raptors beat them Tuesday night, 125 to 89. Oh, David, that's on yeah. some of our old scores. That's a that's a score from uh, the books there. 125 points in the NBA game. There's been many of them like that, but you don't see it all the time. Well, David, it was over before it, it was, began. That's exactly right. Let's go to camera number two and get a, get a close up shot. See if he can give us. Look at there. Get my big Man, that boy the is way. on the ball today. Well, Dave, I'll, item number 3818, yeah. 49.95. Again, not too much, right. but a nice little beer tap. Philadelphia tap. 76ers. They're coached the by Coach Brett Brown. And like I said, off to a little shaky season this year, guys. But if you're a fan, this would go great in your man cave. All right. Well, David, back then they were not shaky when, when this was probably out. They were a great team. Got a little threaded part right there, David, where you put it on there, but right. nice little item, especially for item number 30 Item number 3818, guys, the beer tap is uh, is going today for forty nine ninety five. It's our item number 3818. That's right. What and now, this is unique. That is neat. Guys, we've got an autographed football here. It was autographed by Lou Holtz, who was the coach at that time of the South Carolina Gamecocks. Right. And we do need a close-up of this because this is a great-looking football. Yeah, well, David, I believe it's got the game cock on there. Leather ball with their emblem on it. Looks great. Lou Holtz's autograph is on the back, guys. It's got, he, he wrote the autograph to a gentleman named Eric Johnson. I've seen that. But Holtz's uh, autograph is on the back of that one. We're going to try to get a close-up here if we can wake our cameraman up. Yep. Item 3820, uh -huh. 79.95. But nice out there. there. Good go. shot. I mean, mm -hmm. you wait, David, and there it is. But David Lou Holtz, right. now he's got some North Carolina ties. We saw where he coached different places. Yeah. But at NC State, he was there. In 2001 and 2002, they were the Outback Bowl champions. That's right. That, I think that's the, the football was, was from that, that time. So football was from back when they won the Outback Bowl. And right. they won it in two years, 2001. And Lou Holtz. He, he, he coached back in the 70s at NC State. All right. He was a great coach, but he coached at NC State from 1972 to 75, Gray. He went on to go into a professional football career with the Jets.
I saw that. And uh, yeah, then he coached at Arkansas, Minnesota, Notre Dame, USC, and f he was at University of South Carolina probably till his retirement. But in 2005, they got in a little bit of trouble and put on probation. Yeah, that happens from time to time. It David. happens but a nice lot. Nice item, 39.95, 38.20. David, give that back to you. We got another autograph item Sean, coming up yeah. too, Grace. Ken Griffey, who? Ken Griffey Jr. Okay, yes. I remember him. He hit some home runs, didn't he, David? He was also referred to a lot as Junior and the Kid back then. Ken Griffey, his dad was a great ball player in the earlier years. Um, Autograph baseball with a certificate of authenticity. Very good, David. Yeah. I was going to help you with that. You yeah. Cer that. Certificate of authenticity. You got it. Don't, don't try to we, say it here, twice. you hold it there. Let's give a good shot there. of that in that case with Mr. Ken Griffey Jr. And Ken Griffey Jr., he, he actually played 22 years in the majors. Yep. There he is. hit a total of 630 home runs. He was an outfielder, and like I said, they always referred to him as Junior or either, right. uh, or either the kid. But David, he wasn't a kid if he hit six Good ball player, first-round draft pick. I was still in high school. 1987 he come out, but he was a first-round draft pick. But he's a great player. Uh, didn't have many injuries, but 38-14, right. 189.95 here and this on is PSN. A, actually a Pepsi commemorative. If you want to turn it Just around, Gray, it it's, it's got some engraving there on mm -hmm. the front. Uh, there's your certificate of authenticity. Yep, and David said that again. I'm so I proud did. of him. We rehearsed that. But 189.95, David, a little bit of history there. If you were big like the Seattle Mariners, some of those guys, King Griffey Jr. was a good player. He was a great ball player, guys. And if you're a baseball fan, that's for you. 189.95 is our number 3814. Sounds a little drastic for a price, guys, but if you know what the autograph memorabilia cost, you know what, what it is. Well, David, too, we would take a little less, people. Hey, give us a call. If you're That's interested what we like in to that do. baseball, guys, give us a call right now. See what we'll take. Talk to Mr. Kenny Barnes. If he doesn't answer that phone, you ask for him. Mm -hmm. And you tell him you want to buy that. That's right. Tell him you want to buy it and make him an offer. I'm sure that somebody's going to be very happy at the end of the day. Yes, sir. Today we got some cards this here is with, cool. with a little bit of North Carolina <laughs> history again. These are cool, Michael guys. Jordan. We've got some Michael Jordan cards, but they're not basketball cards, guys. We've got a set of six. One, two, three, four, five. Is it six or seven cards we have here, Greg? Seven, I believe, David. Lucky seven. We've got seven cards of the era when Michael Jordan was actually playing baseball for the Chicago White Sox. Mm -hmm. We've got seven of his cards, all in great condition. Well, new condition, probably. They're still in the original cases that they were put in. And uh, they get a little shot on camera, two of yeah. those. 1995, David. And everybody nice knows the life. history on Jordan. Great basketball player, oh, guys. Really? And he retired from basketball. I think it was shortly after his father was killed. Yep. Retired from basketball, went on to be a, a, a baseball player. He actually played in Major League Baseball, guys. That's a, oh, yeah. another two sport. 37.93, Dave, is our item number, 19.95 for an old Tar Heel. Now, I like the Tar Heels myself, That's but right. Jordan was a Tar Heel. He played for Dean Smith years ago. Yep. Anyway, guys, that's our last item on the first show here. We're glad you tuned in with us. We hope you'll be back with us in a few minutes. But all you guys out there watching, we appreciate it. Tell your friends about us. We'll be on tomorrow night on Spectrum Cable also at 8 p.m. But uh, give us a call. Make us an offer on these items, and we'll be back with some more in, what, about 10 minutes? At least. Sound shopping's coming yeah, up. Yeah, sound shopping's coming up, guys. Nice musical instruments with Alma and Gray. Stick around. We'll see you. We're gone. Thank you so much. Bye-bye. Hello, and welcome to Pond South Bladenboro. We are number one in the Carolinas at deals and cash when you need it. Drop by and see Jacob Higgs and the crew today for hand-selected jewelry items, musical instruments, tools, and everything else that you need. And as always, y'all come see us. Hey folks, Kenny here at Pond Shopping Network. Thanks so much for logging in to PondSouth.com and shopping our wide variety and selection of jewelry, musical instruments, and collectibles. So once again, thanks for watching. 
Thanks for tuning in, and let's go pawn shopping. And here we are, Gray. Sound shopping. Again. I tell you. My favorite portion of the show. Well, I mean, this is your thing most definitely. Well, it's and my, I'll help you all my I thing because I love music. That's all. I just I love music. So um, we're so glad y'all are joining us. We hope you have been here for every show prior to this and you're just a fan and you're liking us and loving us and giving us some thumbs up and howdy's on Facebook and uh, sharing us on Facebook with all your friends. Gray, how have you, how have you enjoyed the show so far? I like it. Uh, we're getting some comments. We see where people are watching. We want that. Give us a thumbs up. Say hello. PSN just getting going real good. Alma now, what, with sixth, seventh show? Yeah, this is actually our seventh Seems show. Seems like just mm -hmm. yesterday we started. Yep. And we've had a great time, you know, and how it works every week. We come and we, we bring you 25 more items each week, and we add that to our website the morning of our show. So you can go right online. You can shop on our online store. You can call us while we're on air. And, you know, one of the unique things about the show is that these items are one and one only. We don't have an, an inventory of you know, 20, 30, right. 40, 100 items. They're all one and one only items. And we're going to so. let people know that. Also, guys, some of the items sometimes maybe not free shipping. Now, I believe everything here we can, but once in a while there may not be free shipping. But call our guys and we'll talk about that. That's right. If it's something really heavy, obviously we can't do free shipping. But right. for the most part, we're trying David. to offer you we free shipping. Ship David. That's right. All right, well, let's we kick it off one. with our first item. Our first item is an Ovation guitar. And, Greg, you know, I always like talking about Ovation guitars. You know, Ovation guitars are known for this fiber bowl back that you see there. And this is an acoustic electric 12 string Ovation. I saw it had too many strings on it. <laughs> I don't have too many, but it has double of <laughs> each one. It has 12 strings. That's, that's right. right. And it is a, it's a up. celebrity model. This is a, a great guitar. You know, I've all, we've had a few Ovations on prior to this show. I think we've had and maybe two other Ovations. We have. And, you know, I'm always impressed with the history and the background of things. So I always try to share a little bit of tidbit with y'all. And if you've watched, you already know. But I always um, was very impressed with the creator of the Ovation guitar. Yeah, he did not give up. No, Charles Kamen. He was an Aero dynamicist for United right. and um, he worked on helicopter designs and then he started his own um, helicopter company helicopter design mm -hmm. company came in aircraft and you know a lot of different things happened back this is back in the 50s right. and um, finances and other things he tried all kinds of different careers and ended up getting a few other aerodynamicists and engineers together and they built this guitar well, so well, that's, he did a little bit of everything and he did not give up and come out to a nice guitar it does not have too many strings on like alma said it is a 12 string mm. that's about the best i could do it is a, it is a great great little guitar there y'all 389 95. that ain't bad no, great price, great right, price, good side. guitar 37 um, 47 is our item number there we go and this does come with the case so um all right, this does go with the case, and this is the sunburst color to it, and we're getting a, a message from his daughter. Lily yeah, says Lily. hi. Hello, Lily. Say hi How to are Lily. You? So, so, you know, if you're watching and you want to send us a message, go ahead. We'll try to capture that on the air. Yeah, I'm glad um, she's watching. We need the younger audience, Alma. Yeah, she should be at school, though, shouldn't she? She is at school, I oh, believe. Oh, and she's at school watching us on Pawn Shop right. Network. So hello, How great there. is hello, that? Hello, Gators. Hello, East Columbus <laughs> High School. There you go. All right, so let's nice uh, put that one back up. Y'all give us a call, 3747, if that's an item of interest to you. Um, you know, we have other guitars on our site, so if you're just wanting to see what we have, do go on there and click on shop and click on musical and you can scroll down and, and, and check on the guitars. Now, now we have this is, another guitar. A, this is not a guitar. This <laughs> is a, what I like to call a fiddle, but we're going to call this. Call it a fiddle it's too. a kneeling I'm violin for right. practical purposes <laughs> and I guess proper purposes here. I'm um, in good shape. Kneeling is a good made right. violin. This is kind of your student model. It is a full size 4-4 scale. Um, this is a synthetic hair bow, not right. your regular horse hair. It's synthetic. Most people, I that's saw what that. A lot of them were made out of horse hair, yeah. but this is synthetic. That's but, uh, right. Nice. Did I say that right? You did. Synthetic. You're yeah. good. You're we're good. Doing good He's a country boy. We're, we're teaching right. him how I to talk. Sit, I call it a geek talk. We're teaching him. <laughs> we're trying to teach him how to talk on TV, but uh, right. he's getting a little better. Well, one forty nine ninety five. It's everybody's budget. And I don't, Item 3751, give us a call here on PSN. And, you know, it's in great shape, too. So, you it know, is. if you've got that student wanting to play, this will be a good good choice for you. And a case Turn does it around come again. with that. We've got good condition, like nice. I said. You know, y'all, these are used items, so they're not well, going to be. Used but not abused. That's right. We 
you know, our guys go out to our 10 pawn shop stores here in North and South Carolina, and they choose some of the best That's items right. that we want to feature here on the show. So go into all those stores for each category, the jewelry, the collectibles, and the music, and they pick out, you know, your rare items, just the best condition items, and that's what we're doing. We're bringing them to you here live on the air for you to take a look at. So if y'all want this, give us a call. Nice item. Like I said, Alma, $149.95. That's everybody's budget. Some of these fiddles slash violins, they can be right on up there, Alma, pretty good. No, they can. You know, I think we had one on here a few weeks ago that was really pricey. Right. All right, so we're going to go to another electric guitar here. This is an That's Area Pro. Um, this guitar has got a little bit of age on it. You know, we're thinking it's maybe 80s, 90s, um, somewhere in that era. This is a Japanese made. You know, it's a copy mm -hmm. of the Gibson Les Paul. You know, if y'all were to buy a Gibson Les, Les Paul, Paul, you're going to be spending thousands of dollars. Oh, yeah. This is a great entry level collector guitar. It is in, it's a solid guitar. It feels good and heavy, don't it, Gray? It does. It's in real good shape. It does have a few nicks, but we're trying to represent what it is. It is used. Right. So a little places here or there. We want you to see that. But that's why it is also $5.99 instead of up there pretty good. And still, again, you're not going to find a guitar with this age right. on it. You know, this is in a good condition. And, you know, now they make them in China, and the materials they use, it's just not the quality that they did 20, 30 years ago. Right. But, Alma, it is heavy. I like to say if it's got some weight to it, there is something to it. That's but right. a pretty good guitar for that price, item thirty-seven forty-two. And let's see, look, look at the back. Where he did? Turn good. it around. Yeah. Pretty guitar, very pretty guitar. Good, pretty color, nice. everything. Five ninety nine ninety five. If that's you, give us a call. Give We'd us love a call. To hear from you. Talk you know, to if you, you want to make an offer, man. you know, give us a call. If you want to make an offer, right. we're willing to make an offer. Give us a call. Talk to one of those pawn brokers and uh, let us know what you would give for it, and we'll, well see Alma, if we, we can make a deal. We can't stress that enough. Please, like five ninety nine. Give us a call. Make them an offer. All they can say is yes or no. That's right. That, you know, Kenny's my, in a selling mood. My motto is, you know, if you don't ask, the answer is no anyway. It, it, so, it is no. That's right. So go ahead and give us a call. All right, we're now. You know, we've decided um, on Sound Shopping to feature vinyl records every week. So each week we're going to bring you a collection, maybe three or four of the same artists or different artists from the same genre. Um, we might mix it up a little bit. So here we have a collection of albums. We have um, ACDC. That's right. We do have ACDC. And what's the name of that one? This is um, on the bottom. Flick here. of the Switch. Of the now switch. I'm not. Um, this is not my style of music, but I, I remember it. I'm, they're I'm a little familiar, heavy. Yeah, they're heavy. <laughs> I'm familiar with them, and I know there's plenty of people out there that this is your sure, thing. So, that's right. um, flick, flick of the, of the switch, switch, ACDC. Then we have Pink Floyd, and the Pink Floyd album album is The Dark Side of the Moon. Now, I have heard of that. That's uh, a, yeah, that's, that's a popular, pretty popular. Yeah, and I was wondering if that that's not a double album. It's a single album. Yeah, yeah. The Dark Side of the Moon by Pink Floyd, and then the final one is Morrison Hotel. That's from Morrison. By the doors, so yeah. I do like the doors. Well, that um, a lot of movies and stuff made about that and about their story, but that is a nice out Morrison Hotel. Yeah, and you know these are in great condition. Well, well, everybody heard the doors. Like I said, that is a great story. I mean, I'd say fair condition. Obviously, yeah. it's not new, but you know, it's kind of funny now that they're bringing vinyl back and they have. You know, I went to Walmart the other day and there's. The whole section There's of records. vinyl records, yeah. That's good. The kids yeah. need to see what a kids record is. Kids don't know really what is. a record is. Let's yeah. get a shot well, of that on camera, too. Let me help Mr. Ethan out of there. This and y'all, we have a price on that of fifty nine ninety five for all three. If there's one album there, yeah, there. that you that you like that uh, and you don't want the others, give us a call. Make us an offer. That's yeah, what it's all about. You know, if you see one that you just want to have in your collection or you need to have to complete your collection, definitely give us a call, and we would... Uh, Break that up if you're interested, and we'll see what we can do for you. Oh, well, there's their lead guitar. That guy, he's the one who jumps around on stage. I do remember him. 37, 38, 59, 95. And that's for all three. Give us a call, 1 641 pond. But all three of those items for that, Alma. There we go. Nice item. All right, so if you're joining us now and you're on Facebook, I was just going to take a quick look to give a shout out to anybody that's watching. I don't know who is. Well, we want that. Say hello. Tell us. You know, if you know something about the things, put on there like, hey, that's the so and so, and you, whatever you know, yeah, all. We you appreciate need to, the information. Yeah, educate us if you need to. Um, say hey to James. Hey, James, there. I see um, Tad Sigmund is watching and very love. Yeah, Thank y'all for joining that. in. And, uh, Give us a thumbs up. If you have a question about anything, do ask us. We'll try to get to right, right. to you. Well, but it's and, a pretty geek talk. Now, this is a Fender. <laughs> I, don't even, I don't even have this on my uh, list today, but this is a beautiful guitar. This is a Fender gu electric guitar. 
What is the model on that? Do you have uh, that information on your paper? You know, Miss Alma messed up here. Say, Mr. Leo Fender, though, is the one who come up with this stuff. Let me see if we can get the model. I messed up. That's okay. Let's see. We have a model FMT. Uh, the pickups. We do have a Gator case with that also, I see. Yeah, and nice everybody, everybody's familiar with Fender. You know, it's a well-known guitar, well-known middle of the road there. Price on that, $499.95. That is a great price. Beautiful condition there. I don't right. see any... This major one wear a, we, on it at all. We would say good condition on that or great. It doesn't have any, hardly any nicks, no nothing. Just pretty. Four ninety nine ninety five. Very pretty. Give nice. us a shout out. Thirty seven thirty four is our item number. The Telecaster, it's a Fender Telecaster, FMT. There we go. See. FMT. Sounds like See, a See, somebody shouted that out to me on Facebook. That's what we need we when we mess up that. like that. That's the the joy of live television and live <clears throat> broadcasting. Y'all can help us out. That was actually our producer helping me out, so that was good. All right, y'all, that concludes our sound shopping for Already. today. Um, we have another episode of Gray, David and Gray, and Grandma's Buffet coming up next. And then Chad and I will close the hour out with the last segment from the Jewelers Vault. We hope y'all have enjoyed it, and we hope you tune in next week. Share us, like us, keep us rolling. Thank you so much. Take care. Hello, everyone. This is Dale with Pond South of Hope Mills. I come to you today as the Dill King of Hope Mills. I wanted to show you how you can save money on a daily basis. Check out our post and our Facebook page. Every day, we will save you much, much, much money. So always remember, we're number one in the Carolinas and number one in your heart. The prices of these things will get you back to the good old boy days where <laughs> cash is king. I told you David yeah, was back. I'm back. David's back. All right. <laughs> Had to throw that in there. Now let's get here. Hey, everybody. You know, the smartphone is the store experience of the future. One of the reasons we launched this show. So log in to PondSouth.com and let's go pawn shopping. There we, we go. Are, David. We're back. Every time it looks just like us. That, that picture on the screen over there looks like us, Gray. Grandma's Look Buffet with David yeah. and Gray. David, that's got a ring to it. Yeah, it does. Sounds like us. Grandma's Buffet with David and Gray. Yeah. And we are here to make your day. Well, David, so far we have really enjoyed Grandma's Buffet. We and we've been very popular. We're hitting some people in West Virginia actually that's made right, a purchase Gray. up there from us. We appreciate that. Some of the what the Coca-Cola stuff. Me and Gray have an agenda here, guys. We're we're gonna use this to get nationwide. That's right. We're gonna start here and go there. We're going there. Matter that's of right. fact, if any producers are out there, give you know, you can give us a call. We'll give you our number, you know. Our call, people talk to you yeah, people. call our phone lines. They'll give you a personal phone number. That's right. That's right. Anyway, back to reality. <laughs> we've got some nice racing stuff here for you guys. And then at the end, we've got one real nice piece that mm -hmm. I'm just amazed with, this, uh, this, this last item we've got on this show. But uh, first, we're going to start out with our racing memorabilia here. To Who start we got? with, we've got, a, yeah, we've got a die cast, a car. Um, Number eight Budweiser 2003 Monte Carlo. Right. Well, Dale Jr. was a very popular driver, I think, David. About every year he raced in the NASCAR circuit, right. not the boot. He was the most popular driver, and for good reason. Mm -hmm. He was good, but and he also he, had a yeah. famous father, David. That's right. He was he was a good race driver. He won he some races, and he, you know, he, he top ten finishes oh, yeah. all the time. He, sometimes he'd just miss it by... A mishap or, or something at the end, but during the time er Earnhardt Jr. was there, he was a great race driver. Well, David, he was a third generation uh, race car driver. Had some big, big shoes to fill. He did right. pretty good, I thought. He never won a championship, got mm -hmm. close, but now his daddy did. His daddy did, and, and Dale Jr., actually, I can remember, guys, for those of you that are local, I've watched him race several times at the Myrtle Beach Speedway. Oh, yeah. He'd come in there, and he had a white car with no sponsors and it was my understanding his daddy told him he'd help him with the car Go he'd help him get sponsors. it ready yeah. but you're going to have to do the work and get you some and sponsors. he did he, and he did. did he finally did he finally in the next few years he was oh, yeah. he was right there in the 
than the lineup at Daytona for That's the first right. race. Well, let's get let's our get a close up our view king, of the box. Like Richard you want to pop the we'll box a, on that one? Let him take a look at the seat. car. Yeah. There's actually a car in there. Yes, and it's got a see-through window. No, you have to take top off of that Nothing one. To do the whole thing. Look get at it there. on camera number two there, Ethan, if you can. Let's get a shot of the car. 124 scale. Look at there, David. That looks like yeah. it's rolling out of Rockingham or Darlington or some of those tracks, David. <laughs> I can remember when it did and the crowd be standing up. That's right, screaming. Guys. But 1995, David. For those of you that collect them, you know the price of these things, and this is another one price will sell. Uh, right. 1995, we'll ship it directly to you. We'll get it out of here today if at all possible. Depends right. on how the UPS man acts this afternoon. That's right. 4752 for that Dale Jr. model car, David. 2003, the Monte mm -hmm. Carlo. But a beautiful car. You know, he switched later on to the 88 car. Right. But this was the Red Budweiser car. Right. 1995, He, he put a lot of miles on those Budweiser cars, too. Yeah. Anyway, guys. Rolls and everything. Give us a call. <laughs> give us a call at the number 844641 PAWN Pond. And today, you can actually talk with our owner, Kenny Barnes. He's manning the phones back there with some other guys. And you will be talking to someone with some knowledge. Oh, yeah. We're not, we don't have an answering service here, guys. You're going to talk to real people, and uh, most of them can speak English. That's a that what we got here. You know what that is playing cards, playing cards, and Dale, who Dale Earnhardt, so more Senior. Earnhardt. Yeah, now this the father, of course, of the first one we're showing. This is the right. black number three, yeah. David. What a car it was, the it Monte was Carlo, but nice. the intimidator is what it was, he would do that. and it was, guys. This come. It's a set of playing cards, two decks. One of them is actually unopened. One of them has been opened right. and may be used, maybe not. The cards look new, but the deck has been opened. The other is still in the plastic. But you have two decks of playing cards. Again, the price will sell these. $11.95 so. shipped directly to you. Have the tin and have the original box there. Let me get a shot of Ethan there with those cards, David. Like I said, some of them are not opened. A lot of people are superstitious mm -hmm. when it comes to yeah. playing cards. This you can actually see opened. the glare on the plastic on oh, one, yeah. and you can see the glare on Dale's face on the other one. Dale, he, uh, Dale, yeah. Dale, he actually had a look about him, the mustache and those glasses. If you notice, you could not see his eyes. He was the intimidator. He did that on reason, David. He didn't want you to see his eyes. He wanted you to leave a little bit, you know? That's right. <laughs> Guys, but, uh, these were actually made back in the year 2000. 1195, I think, David. I couldn't see the screen there 47 for 4751 <laughs> is our number. Call and talk to these guys. Like we say, if you don't like the price you see, make them an offer. This is the first time showing for some of these things, so you may have to wait to get a lower price, but give it a try. Give it a try. Give us a call, 1-8-641-844-641-PON. We'd be glad to talk to you. Another day I learned heart commemorative here guys we've got the two die cast cars in the uh well, this is the looney tune car i don't know David. what the looney tune yeah i don't know what well, the scale the is but it's kind of like the <laughs> kind of like the matchbox size let's get them where they can actually see these cars that's the tasmanian devil on that one David. tasmanian devil looney tunes on one and the other's a good wrench put them right car. here drive them right here in this here, take take the whole thing over oh, there with right. you we'll nice put them right here david Let's if we can get a see. shot of that. Number three GM, good wrench service. David, that looks like they're in the Limited infield, edition. lined up, fixing to go race. That's right. Another one from the year 2000. Yep. These things are already almost 20 years old. Right. All this stuff's getting old. Well, 995, David, 47.56 here on PSN. Give they us a call. They look brand new, off. guys. Yep. Another one to price will sell, 995. It's a no-brainer. Give us a call. We'll ship it to you. That's right. Um, these things here are out here to sell today. We're not, uh, we're not planning on making a museum out of this NASCAR stuff. It, it's priced to go, so give us a call. For less than 10 bucks, we can put this in your collection. $9.95, David, everybody's budget. I know Father's Day is coming up, Mother's Day. Right. And either mother, mother or father, $9.95, David. That's, we could help you out here on PSN with your Mother's Day and Father's mm. Day gifts, anniversary, add, anything. Add to your collection, guys. That's right. Add to your collections. But nice item, especially for nine ninety five. The tin's nice too, guys. Got nice artwork on there. The Tasmanian Devil and the Intimidator, both on the lid. And uh, next, we got a couple of things for the guys that like hat pins. 
Right. Well, they, they're very popular at the races. The ones I attend, the guys would buy the event pins, right. also these, and they would put them on their hats, and they would show their loyalty for their driver. David, back then, you had one driver. Everybody now pulls for this one or that one. You had right. one guy and one guy only. And one. That was your man, yeah. And you could tell there were some drivers that everybody liked. Or disliked. But you had one driver that usually was your driver, and you had the, you had the hat, you had the jacket, uh, you know, and people would get angry and fight over it. David, I've seen them throw the beer throw cans, the beer bottles. They'd throw each other at people. That's I'm right. telling you, especially in Darlington. That's when NASCAR was NASCAR. They got out and raced. Well, it went PG. That's right. Went PG. Went from R to PG, yeah. I guess, didn't it? That's right. Anyway, two a set of pins, guys, for twelve ninety five lapel pins or hat pins, whichever you'd like to use them for. The number three with the Dale Earnhardt signature, that's a pure pewter pen. You I might want to get a close up of that. of that one. Let's see if we can get that. That on one's there. solid pewter, it says on there. It is solid pewter. Mm -hmm. It says it right on the front. Nice look size for a hat. It's not overbearing if you wanted it on there. It's not right. going to be something look like a badge or anything. Right. $12.95, David. Forty-seven fifty dollars is our item number for that. The other one here is nice an enamel item. picture of Dale. Same thing, 2000, Dale Earnhardt number two edition of the Pinhead Collection. Um, year 2000, they made six of these. They made Dale Earnhardt, Dale Jr., Tony Stewart, Bobby Labonte. I don't know who the other two were, but they had all six of these drivers in the year 2000. Right. But nice item nice there, items. David. For, for the price, twelve ninety five. some history there. I mean, of course, he mm -hmm. left us the wreck at Daytona. Uh, what was it, 2001? Give Seems us a like call. So we ship now. it to you. It's yeah. amazing that these things were actually made before his death. Right. After his death, racing changed, guys, but his, his memorabilia, if you remember, just after the wreck, it was people were David. buying everything, buying it up. Well, I still went to a lot of races then, David. Uh, paying outrageous he prices actually, they for They had it. the black number three car still coming to the races. Right. They had his truck. Right. What you got left, anyway, there, David? Guys, this is something, this is neat. We've got a 1964 Life magazine that was from March the 6th. This was a month after Cassius Clay had beat Sonny Liston for the World, for the World Heavyweight Championship. And back in February, I think it was February 22nd or so, um, he actually, well, it's February 25th, 1964, Cassius Clay beat Sonny List and became the world champion at 22 years old. Right. And all of you know, from there on, he had a career as Muhammad Ali. This thing has got a lot. Let me just breeze right quick, and then I'm going to let Gray show you a picture on camera, too, of the Well, David, I can remember Life picture. Magazine. Yeah. It just had whatever was going on in that era. It had color pictures of it. And, y'all, this was the Internet of the time. But Life Magazine, everybody, David, I say over yeah. 30 years old knows what it is. Life exactly. Magazine. Let me get just a few highlights off the table of contents on this one, guys, because the price is going to sell it again. This thing's $14.95, 15 bucks for a Life Magazine from 1964, and we're going to ship it to you. Clay defeats Listman. Heroism at Sea, Coast Guard Rescue, Mexico-U.S. Summit Meeting, Nuclear Way to Deed Canal. Just the Queen Elizabeth II starting out the, uh, the new ship. A lot of great stuff in this from 1964, guys. A lot of history back in the 60s. Oh, yeah. Good show. Early 60s. I'm going I'm to have to get Ethan there. You can show that 1495, 47.53, David, but nice Call item. us. Call Give us, us because call. we're getting run off of the screen Let's here. get a shot of that before we go, David. Well, that, that is a nice little light. It's in good shape right. for something that old. That thing's older than me, David. Mm -hmm. I was born in the 70s, 1495, 47, David. He's saying we're that. done. We're all washed up. We're Hand washed up. Back. Okay. Yeah. Let's talk to the people one more time before we go. Call on these things, guys. Make an offer. If you see something you like, give us a call. One of a kind items. The Jewelers Vault's coming up with Gray and Alma. I mean, no, with Alma and Chad. Alma and Chad. I'm Gray, you're David. You're Gray, I'm David. We'll be back next week. Hang on for some more stuff, guys. Thank you very much. Thank and you. Goodbye.
Hey everybody, Marco here. I'm a manager from the Palm South Oleander location in Wilmington. I just want to tell everybody, come check out our Facebook page. We got great deals on there. Got a daily deal special. We're posting every day. We'll save you a bunch of money. Please come check out my great staff and get a great deal. And remember, we're the number one in the Carolinas. Hey guys, you might be asking yourself, is this for real? Well, the answer is yes. This is a live pawn shop show called Pawn Shopping Network. Now you can buy from us live, call in, talk to a live pawnbroker, or you can sell to us. So give us a call. Welcome back to the Jewelers Vault. We're back. We are back. This is the last section of our show today. We're excited. We hope y'all have had a good time. We've had jewelry, we've had collectibles and musical items and more collectibles and we're ending it, it like out. We with had them. a lot of collectibles, didn't we? A lot of collectibles that just kept on going and going. Going and, go. and going. But you know, those are good items. So we had some great items. We today. hope you got a good view of it. Yep. Had a good view. history on it. Yeah. We're trying to give them all a hard time, so that's what we're all about. Anyway, we're going to try to squeeze the jewelry in here. Yeah, because they ate up all of our time all of our in the time, last segment. So. We're just picking. No. This is great. Um, so here we go. Um, we're going to just start and kick it off too. with our first item. What did you do? Okay. Yeah. We got a nice three-ring engagement set here. I'm going to hand that to you. All Anna. right, and I'll put it on. Got uh, engagement set, two matching bands. It's one carat total weight, nine ninety nine ninety five. And it's in 14 karat white gold. And you've got, basically you've got your engagement ring in the center. And then you've got two matching bands that go with it. Wow, this is really pretty. Let's get it a little close up pretty. over here yep. on our camera too. If I can get my hand in the right spot there for Mr. Ethan. Yep. That right there not. is a size nine for all three rings and can size those down. Can't go down a whole lot, probably down to like a seven and can size up even farther. As you can see there, you got like the nice center with the halo around it. You got a diamond on each side of that, and then you've got the two matching bands that go with it, all diamonds. It's a beautiful ring. That is really beautiful. Mm -hmm. Look at the fire on them diamonds. That is just really, really pretty. Yeah. Nice and sparkly, and that is beautiful. Mm -hmm. 14 karat white gold, nine ninety nine ninety five. dollars One carat total weight. If it doesn't sell here, you're going to see it on our website I'll later. I'll tell you what, this is going to have to go on that Alma's list of I wants. Mm -hmm. I like that. Which is growing and growing and growing every week. It is week. really growing every week. I like it. I'm starting to get more jewelry than I am musical instruments on that list. You don't see a whole lot of white gold usually, but here we, we've got some white gold. I love the white gold. I really do. Mm -hmm. All right, y'all, that's item 3762. Give us a call, 844-641-PAWN, mm -hmm. if this is the item for you. And uh, you can also shop on our website, pawnsouth.com. Let's go on to our right. next item there, Mr. Chad. This right here is a nice little uh, puffed emerald and diamond heart. The emeralds are really pretty green. You got the diamonds in there. It's kind of a right. basket weave going across there, as you can see. It's beautiful. Ethan's really. going to have to do some good camera work on yeah. this because this is not on the chain. So 14 karat yellow to gold, $229.95. The best I can for y'all, right there. Mm -hmm. You can see it's a beautiful piece. And, you know, I know Mother's Day is just this weekend. We could probably get it to you for then, and um, it makes somebody a nice little graduation gift, too. Really? And of course, being May, that's the birthstone for May, too. Okay. So, there you go. Pretty. Maybe I should get my ring out of the picture so y'all know that's not what we're doing. 229.99? 95. Sorry, we, we went to the fives instead of the nines. Flip that over so you can see. And it's got like a little open mesh back woven there. open back there. Kind of a puff. It's pretty. Hopefully, it'll find a home for somebody here. It is very pretty. That would look nice on the chain. Mm -hmm. You can see the emeralds are nice and green too, which is important. The emeralds shouldn't look like like a jade. Okay. Yeah, Chad nice is our resident jeweler. He mm -hmm. is an expert. He does a fine job. He has a does a lot of building his own stuff, making pieces. And if you have pieces laying around at house, missing stones or rings, just just the setting. Give us a call. We might be interested in purchasing that. That's something we're looking for. I like to throw around the big words so they think I know what I'm talking about. Yeah. We, we think it's pretty good, though. But uh, especially if you have some vintage pieces yeah. laying around at home, um, pieces that you no longer want that are just old and maybe maybe not sentimental to you and mm -hmm. you would be willing to part with, give us a call and uh, see what we can do for you. 
even if it's missed some stones, it's okay. That's right. We hope to patch it up and get it back out there. That's right. Get it back in the game. All right. All right, we'll move on now to a little man's band here, a little diamond band. It's a pretty band, two ninety nine ninety five. It's one fifth of a carat total weight. It's fourteen carat yellow gold. I think that one, the size was pretty small on it. it well, is actually, small. it's a size nine, and I can size that up, folks. But it's just—it's got that little rope finish going down the side. Diamonds, channel set in the middle. And channel means that there's no prongs. It's just set below the surface of the gold. So, put your hand in and out of your pocket. It's not going to snag on things. It's—it's it's pretty durable. You've got five round diamonds in there. Father's Day's coming up. Mm -hmm. um, for people just getting married. That's There's right. a nice band a for you. a wedding band for somebody just getting married. That's a great price there, two ninety nine ninety five. And everything we have has been completely refinished. It looks looks practically new. Some piece, some pieces are new, but but we we've, we've just really done a nice job getting them cleaned up. Size nine again. We can size that right here on on premise, so we can get it done and shipped out to you. That's right, and we do have a 30-day money-back guarantee, so if you were to get that home and uh, you just weren't satisfied with it for whatever reason, however, I don't see why you wouldn't be satisfied with that. That's a really pretty ring, but if for some reason within those first 30 days you are not satisfied, we do have a satisfaction guarantee policy. So, so we're shipping it to you for free, and you get home and you don't like it, you send it back. Yep, it's easy. You just go on our website. You'll see what to do. If you need to return something, you're going to give us a call. We'll give us a, a return order number and send it right there on back is. to us. It's very I mean, easy. There you go. How can you beat that? That's right. All right, we're going to move on to a little bit bigger ring wow. here. Got a nice engagement ring. It's marquee in the center. You got baguettes and rounds going down it. It's all in 14 karat yellow gold. It's a carat and a quarter total weight. Um, it just It's a good looking ring. It's, it's, it's very showy. I show we mean. Uh, yeah, that, you, know. you know, that's a really good picture yeah. that we have up there in the corner. Um, that's a great shot up there. It's a size 10, too, so, you know, it's, it's a bigger ring, so it's, a, it's nice to have that little bit larger size on there, too, because, you know, that's not made for a, a tiny hand. That's made for more of a hand, you know, and <laughs> it, it gives a lot of. Real hand, huh? Yeah, real hand. It's made for a fist. Now. Yeah, fills up a little bit of finger there, so. You can see it's just beautiful. Just the design of it is pretty. It's all channel set except for the center stone being raised up in a six prong setting, which is a Tiffany setting, is what they call it. That, that's uh, white gold prongs on, on the diamond, which shows that off a little bit better. And you got yellow gold on everything else. Just a beautiful ring. You can see those prongs there. Yeah, yep. that is really pretty. You can it see the really baguettes kind of surround it and it's kind of tapered in toward the stone. Just a nice design. You know, I just mentioned, look at the picture in the corner is, is a really nice picture. We have pictures of everything on our website, and we have mm -hmm. a gallery of photos, different angles. The jewelry, we have videos of, of the ring, so you can see every angle. And on the still pictures, whether it's jewelry or a collectible or even a musical instrument, you can take your... Um, Take your mouse and just hover over it, and it'll, it's like a magnifying glass, and it'll enlarge it, and you can zoom in on any, any part of that item that you want to look at so you can see the complete detail of everything that we have. And we have front photos, back photos, side photos, so you can really take a look at what you're buying before mm -hmm. you buy it. And we, we've been talking about buying the vintage piece, but we also you know, scrap gold, silver. And we, we love coins, too. Anything like that that you have that you have no use for, give us a call. Yeah, mm -hmm. and you know, speaking of coins, we've just added some coins to our site. Um, mm -hmm. So if you are a coin collector or mm -hmm. you're interested in that, make sure you hop onto PondSouth.com, click on Shop, and then click on the Coin tab and take a look at what we have. We'll be adding more each week onto that mm -hmm. as well. So we've really got some nice jewelry through here in the jewelers vault, and also the collectibles are really cool too. Yeah. And the music instruments. And we try to pick out the nicest things and put it on yeah. for you to see. So the live show gives you first dibs on it, and then you know if it's on the website. Then if it's there, it's there. If it's not. Yeah. Move on to something else. And of course, you can also watch us on um, Spectrum Cable on Thursday mm -hmm. nights. All right, this is our last and final mm -hmm. item of the day. Ooh, this is really pretty. That Chad. was really pretty right there. It's a nice center stone. You've got a one carat center stone in that. It's all wow. yellow gold. It's a one That's and a third nice. carat. So basically, you've got a one carat center round diamond, then you've got a third of a carat in channel set diamonds on the side. Channel again, set down below the surface. So, you know, they're, they're nice and smooth and kind of flush with the ring right there. Six prong setting on the top. Good looking one carat diamond, twenty eight ninety nine, and folks, just for the one carat center stone right there, it's probably a good thousand or two thousand dollars cheaper just for the stone than it is in most retail stores. 
And that's with them being on sale for the same quality for quality because it's a nice looking ring. Yeah, if somebody was out there and wanted to buy this today, this would mm -hmm. put me and you over the top on the um, yeah. item selling. We'd, we'd outdo those collectible guys. They've mm -hmm. been bragging because they've sold more items than us. But um, you know what? If y'all would somebody want this, you would really be helping us out today. Yeah, we, we, we sell, we sell the, the bigger end pieces. And, yeah. You know, and it wouldn't take much to... That's right. To, well, these would knock them out of the cry. ballpark, wouldn't we? That's right. And I promise if you buy it, we'll, we'll film them crying. I would love to see David cry. And Gray, too, I think. Yeah. I'd love to see him crying together. We would film it and let y'all see that. So oh, yeah. buy this ring, make them cry, make our day. There you go. Um, Size boxed and shipped. That's right. It, it is... Um, like you said, a beautiful diamond. It is. A carrot in the center. That's a carrot by itself in the center, right? Yeah. Even if you're just looking for the carrot center stone, you can always put it in something else. It's it's a deal yeah. at that just for the center stone. It's Whether you wear yellow gold, white, or whatever, just the diamond alone is, is worth, worth that or more. So there you go. We hope you are uh, watching us from all over the mm -hmm. globe, and somebody is going to want this today. I just have a good feeling about this. Somebody give us mm -hmm. a call. Let's give those guys something to do back there on the telephones. All right, folks. Well, we're going to be back next one. week. Yeah. We will be back next week. You know, in the meantime, you can watch us again anytime mm -hmm. you want to. You can hop onto our Facebook page and watch any of our episodes. Oh, and yeah. then, um, of course, on Spectrum Cable Thursday nights from 8 to 9, check out our website for the channel guide for that. And, you know, also, you can go right to our website to pondsouth.com. This mm -hmm. is our website. And when you're on there, you're just going to click on shop. You know, if you have a question, this little bubble is going to pop up down there in the corner. You'll see it says, you want to chat with someone, you can chat with us now. Make sure you check out our website. That's pondsouth.com for anything you might need. Oh, yeah. Y'all take care, and we will see you next Wednesday, high noon. Thanks, folks. Take care.